Today we are going to be hunting one of the most adorable little fish in the world. This fish is high class. It's fancy. It's nice. It might honestly be better than a turtle. Sorry, turtles. I love you. You're like one of my favorite animals. You're slow, just like me. And you're just like, you're just so chill. Like, look at him. Look at him. But I think, I think we have found a more better animal. Before this video starts, I need you guys to click that subscribe button and slap the bell to never miss another video. Guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Unspeakable, and today we're going to be hunting for the best fish in minecraft now this is actually an add-on so these fish are not no oh what the flip is that that's the fish oh it's vicious oh my gosh look at it it's literally about to jump out of water bro are you good maybe if i jump in the water it will like calm down hey buddy are you okay oh my gosh it's eating my face it's literally eating my face i don't think you know i don't i don't really think that's it why can i hurt you here get get out of here buddy what kind of fish are you you are not what I was lo- Oh, piranha! Wait, I thought piranhas were supposed to be cute and cuddly. I th Oh, wait. No, 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 no. That's not the fish I was thinking about. Well, ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to check out the piranha add-on in Minecraft. Before, we looked at multiple add-ons that changed the ocean Minecraft, because recently we just got the 1.13 update, which completely changed the ocean. So a lot of creators and modders have been coming out with add-ons and mods for the ocean, such as adding in sharks and adding in all these crazy things but we've never yet to see piranhas in our Minecraft world. For those of you that are watching this video, I know 99% of you, but there might be that 1%, that one couple people that are watching this that I have no idea what a piranha is. A piranha is a small fish that is very vicious with very sharp teeth. I don't know the exact specifications on a piranha, but I do know that if they to you they're gonna literally eat your leg off so please be safe around piranhas so that's your daily knowledge on a piranha in minecraft look there's a baby one so in this add-on there is different size piranha look how vicious this guy's teeth are oh my gosh he's literally an animal i mean he is an animal but yeah. anyways oh my gosh look at its face what if i just try to swim away from it dude can i make it away from it no no, it's not gonna happen. The, the, look how the the piranhas are so fast. If I try to dive into this water and try to run away from one of these piranhas, what is gonna happen? Okay, so I'm running. There's a sea turtle. Oh, there's a piranha behind me. No matter how fast I try and swim, the piranha will be attacking you. So if you want a more difficult ocean in Minecraft, this is definitely the add-on for you. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no! <laughs> The only bad thing I'd say about this add-on is this turns your whole entire ocean or any body of water into Piranhaville. For this add-on, the piranhas actually replace the salmon, which is one of the most common fish in your Minecraft world. So you're going to see these piranhas almost everywhere you go. You're going to see them more than you see turtles. There is also different sizes of piranhas. Let's get a fish tank. So I figured out it's very hard to get these piranhas in actually inside the tank. They don't really seem to go. But I've gotten a small one and a large one and a medium all right here. Not in different tanks. And there's a bunch of other ones flopping around. I'm so sorry. If you look right here, that is a small piranha. The small piranhas do six attack damage. And then next to it is actually a medium sized piranha. The medium piranhas also do six attack damage. I am assuming there's really no difference between the small and medium piranhas. But this piranha on the other side is the large piranha. Actually, I think think these are both large piranhas i don't know this one looks a little bit bigger anyways if you see a huge piranha coming at you he's going to do 10 attack damage which means he can kill you in just about two hits if he gets really good hits on you so pretty much if you see piranhas in the water hopefully you're close to land if you see a big piranha in the water hopefully you have diamond armor there's actually more in this add-on than just the fish themselves there is also raw piranhas and then you have you know you can spawn them you have a cooked piranhas as well, and then you have a bucket of piranhas. Now, this can be used to spawn a single piranha, or you can go in the ocean and just kind of drop some piranhas in there. Isn't this just wonderful? Let's just spawn hundreds of these in this area, and let's see how long it takes them to kill one unspeakable. All right, so we have, um, I'd say at least minimum 100 piranhas in this area. I am going to drop straight into this pit of piranhas. Ladies and gentlemen, here goes nothing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There's so many of them. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, I survived. 
Ow! How did I survive that? I really don't know, but you can see just how aggressive they are. Now, in real life, piranhas are just as aggressive as this as well. They're extremely fast, extremely vicious animals. If you've ever seen videos of piranhas eating, they're pretty scary. Now, that I can tell you right there, these three right there are the large piranhas. All these other ones are medium ones, and then those little babies that you see kind of swimming around. What the f those little babies that you see swim around in the background, those are the small ones. Like that one right there, that's a medium one, and these are the large ones. So you can see the large ones, are they're huge. They're some pretty good sized fish. All right, let's see how much longer we can survive. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I don't think I've gotten a large one hit me yet. I think these are all medium ones. Oh no, there's, there's one large one there. Okay, well, I'm dead. So it's pretty hard to make it through the ocean with a bunch of vicious piranhas swallowing you. Now, since I've showed you guys the piranhas and everything about them, it's time for some fun. These piranhas will actually attack anything. They just killed a sheep that was close to the edge. As you can see, there's the wool right there. Poor sheep, I'm sorry. Let's build a piranha cage and let's drop a bunch of different mobs into it and see who wins. Piranhas or other Minecraft mobs? We got our cage right here. Now we need to fill it with piranhas first, which is what we're going to do right now. We're going to put probably, I don't know, maybe 20, 30 piranhas in here. And then there's a block right here. That's where we're going to be spawning the mobs and then kind of pushing them into this giant pit. All right, so we got a solid amount of piranhas in here. There is a ton of fish in there. Okay, all right. Let's try a simple animal. Let's just try a pig. Hey, buddy. I I know you. I know you don't want to go in there, but uh, you really don't have a choice. So, ah! <laughs> oh snap! Just completely eats them. I'm so sorry. So I picked out in my hot bar nine different mobs that I think would be the most fun to drop into this piranha pit. So we're gonna do that. So first one we have is a creeper. I have no idea if the piranhas. Okay. Never mind. They will kill. Oh, okay. That was pretty cool. What about an Enderman? Oh, snap. What did he? Oh, we teleported outside. <laughs> okay. Well, the Enderman's kind of overpowered there. What if we just try spawning one? Oh, wait. I am a dumb dumb. Endermans can't go in water. Yeah, so they're kind of invincible when it comes to piranhas. What about a little chicken? Oh, look at the piranhas. They're like, oh, what <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. So far, only the Enderman has taken a win. What about a llama? Hello, llama. I know you enjoy spitting, but do you like water? I'm gonna have to push you in there a little bit, buddy. There you go. There you go. Oh my gosh. The llama is immune to piranhas. What? Oh, that's not what I expected at all. Okay. The llamas are immune to piranhas as well as Enderman. That's interesting. Now we got a slime. Oh, of course, the slime is not, oh, but the slime did get out. That's just because our walls weren't tall enough. But if we were to put a slime, no, 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 get back in there, get back in. Oh, oh snap, oh, oh yeah, that completely just swallows slimes. The llama, on the other hand, is still just chilling, okay? That's, out of all the animals, I expected the llama to get, like, destroyed, but whatever. <laughs> now we got a vindicator, I wonder. Do piranhas like vindicators? Yep, they do. Oh my gosh. Oh, I think he just killed one. Oh, he definitely just killed one piranha. Yeah, because I see some piranha meat down there. Okay, what about a wither skeleton? Oh, they look hungry for a wither skeleton. All right, buddy, go in there. Go in there. Oh, snap. He's in the wither skeleton. Oh my gosh. Okay, what about a witch? Oh yeah, they're going to eat the witch. Get in there, buddy. Oh my gosh. Okay, so these piranhas will pretty much eat anything you would want them to. I have another idea. Let's just spawn a ton of these guys. Oh no! Oh no! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! They just completely destroyed the fish tank and there goes so many piranhas. So if anything, I think out of all the mobs that we just checked out, the creeper is going to be the best when it comes to attacking the piranhas because it does have the ability to blow up on all the piranhas. However, if it's trapped underwater, the explosion won't do much, but if it does something like that, then it's going to get rid of a lot of piranhas. Because look at this, we had almost like 70 piranhas in there and there's probably like 15, 20 left. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I want to thank you all so much for watching. This was an awesome add-on and I think piranhas are pretty cool. I'd personally never like to be around one or be near one or be in the same water with one, but they're, they're, they're cool. They're, I guess. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you guys want to see um, more stuff like this on the channel, of course, be sure to leave a like on this video. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a safe and fantastic rest of your day. 
Stay awesome, stay safe, stay unspeakable, and I'll see you guys tomorrow in a brand new Minecraft video.